Hi everybody, Danielle here, Girl Racer Scrap, and I went shopping, another haul video. I was down in Orlando running some errands, and I went to Scrappy Boutique, which is by the Florida Mall, uh, OBT and Sand Lake Road, um, just in case you want to look that up. Uh, and if you're uh, in the area, vacationing, Disney World, go there, it's awesome. A lot of this stuff is a little bit older, it's just new to me, I haven't been able to get it, so... I picked up some stuff. Uh, they had the Queen and Company, the trendy tape, which is washi tape. And uh, this is a orange and black chevron, so I thought it was great for Halloween. Here is another one. It is uh, orange, green, and black circles. They kind of look like bubbles. Uh, definitely could be used for other things in Halloween, I think. Then they had a film strip, which this is kind of close to the Michaels version of washi tape film strip, but uh, I think it's a little bit different. So I picked that up. I got these My Mind's Eye Indie Chic labels. I know they're old, but I like them. And uh, the sweetest things, I don't think I got these um, over the weekend in Jacksonville, so I picked these up. I kind of liked, um, I'd turn back if I were you. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Then I got the Heyday Collection by Studio Calico. I'm late on the game on all this stuff. Um, it's been shown in a lot of videos. So, and then I picked up the Shoreline Collection, which I absolutely love. The colors, the neon, just very fun and bright. And living in Florida, I think this is a must. Gotta have it. Then I picked up the matching um, thickers for the Shoreline Collection. I paid full price for a thicker. I can't believe it. I normally don't like to, but I got these. So this matches. It's a teal and white. Um, these are called the Boardwalk. Okay, see that? Hold on. Um, and then also the same one, Boardwalk, in like uh, hot magenta pink. This would go really well with the Hero Arts uh, neon inks. And uh, same font, Boardwalk, in a yellow glitter. Which I'm all about yellow thickers. I also picked up, I think my sheets of paper may be out of order a bit. But I picked up a few larger 12x12 of the Heyday Collection. I'm sorry, I'm showing these sideways. They actually go this way. Um, these are Studio Calico Heyday Upbeat and Jubilant. It's the back side. I don't know. So these are like um, newspaper print balloons, I guess. Um, the blue I picked up, uh, this is another Heyday in Sassafras, which in, I believe this was one that were in, was one of them that was in the kits then. I don't know if it was really available as a single sheet like that. I don't know. I don't know all the facts on that. I really like this grid on the back. Yellow grid. I do this quick. I've been interrupted before. Here's my dog with his little speaker. So speaking of dog, I picked up this dog because it's got wiener dogs. And the little guy squeaking is the wiener dog. So this is a dog park unleashed by Reminis. And the back is brown polka dot. Also from the same collection, Dog Park, this is Dog Park, Dog Park, uh, by Reminisce, or Reminisce, so that was really cute, just to prove that I'm not crazy, it does, you know, Dog Park, and this paper is called Dog Park. And then there are some lines on the back, and then the actual border here has little doggies on it, so you can cut that off and use it. 
This is We Are Memory Keepers Friends Forever Kitty Cat. And there's some red paws on the back. Uh, Best Creations Ink Puppy Love. I just thought it was adorable. And there's glitter on them. They're embossed and glittered. So cute. And I think those are supposed to be little kind of like tennis balls. That's a good solid paper. It's a heavy duty. Then I got some 12 by 12 of the Shoreline collection. Let me try and grab it all. I think I've tried to grab every sheet of the Shoreline that I could. Um, so I'll try and go through these kind of quick. Shoreline Pacific Beach. So they're like bottle caps. And like a fun yellow starburst, I guess. This one here is Columbia. It is all blue, but up here in the corner, it just has these neon dots. And the back with the bottom stripe is hot pink. This one is Catalina. It's so along the bottom, it has area to journal and it says welcome sunshine and the rest is all this hot yellow and then a blue with a little border blue starburst and sunburst I don't know this is carpenteria I don't know I'm not good at that um, so these are kind of like journal spots I mean, they are journal spots. I love the sun and those little surfboards. And the back are surfboards. Myrtle, flip-flops, hot pink grid, and a surfboard border. Melbourne, which is here in Florida. Yay! So I have more surfboards, some kind of blue flower, I don't know. Santa Monica has uh, bicycles and stripes, which is where I like blue. And Coronado, so these definitely look like sunbursts and like in the corner it's orange. And a blue, I want to put these in the proper direction, kind of a blue wave, and a striped edge. So that was it of that collection I got. I picked up one, sorry, two sheets of the My Mind's Eye All is Bright, which is um, Christmas. But this doesn't look Christmassy at all to me. Um, because obviously it's sort of an accent sheet. The only thing I guess that, I guess the music notes make it Christmassy, but it is the All is Bright. In the back, that is a teal aqua color. And here is another All is Bright. This is a craft and dark red chevron. Here is more music notes. It actually says Christmas polka, so that's like the first little bit of Christmas there. And then up in the corner is this little girl. So still, you could definitely use this not for Christmas if you cut off the one side. And um, then I got the boat, boat <coughs> bunny. Sorry. Uh, Sorry for the little interruption. Uh, I, then I picked up the Bow Bunny. It just says Back to Basics. Oh, here, Mistletoe. So uh, the B side is just a red and white chevron. And this is a red, white, and green chevron. And then at the edges, it's they got some little green distressing, top and bottom. I 
I picked up this hockey sheet. So it's got all these little hockey pucks and then little, I don't know, what do you call them, little swirls. Um, I played hockey back in high school and so I still have to go through that stuff So and scrap it. So anytime I find a hockey page, this is On the Edge Sports, Ronnie McCray, I think. Scrapping sports and more. Um, so yeah, so anytime I find one, I pick it up because it's hard to find hockey in Florida. Uh, I picked up some Dear Lizzie Neapolitan vellum sheets. So the clouds, and they are teal. This is called Silver Lining. Um, I had an idea because I want to make my own day book. I keep on that day book delights group on Facebook. And everybody's using acetate. Um, uh, like Hamley screen print type things for their cover to make it look like an Amy Tangerine one. Um, but I thought like what if I did a piece of vellum. And I love this. So I picked up two sheets to play with. Probably not as durable for a cover type sheet, but nonetheless, if it doesn't smell right, I'll put it on the inside. Uh, the last thing is the store had this at 40% off, and this is the Echo Park Splash. Um, so this is last year's, I believe. Yes, it does say 2011. Um, and it's the whole 12x12 12 12 kit. So it comes with all the sticker sheets, the alphas, With little journaling cards, and then I'm gonna. Hmm. These are all the papers that are inside. I don't really feel like opening it, and it is last year, so you guys are probably like, "Why are you showing me this?" Um, but I said, "Well, I love Echo Park, so for forty percent off, I just had to get it." Uh, so that completes maybe my haul. I did pick up a few other things, but I can't show them on video because my friend is watching and she'll know it's for her um so that is it oh no I lied I did I get one more I got the the bits for the shoreline collection sorry they were hiding with my washi tape um so I saw these in a, another video and I really liked them so they are a uh, not really a chipboard just a really thick stock I would say little pieces so that completes my haul uh, you can find me at growracerscrap.blogspot.com and you can also find me uh, Grow Racer Scrap on Facebook I do have a page um, if you want to friend me that way I'm getting a lot of friends in my personal account but I don't really want to accept them I'd rather you like my scrapbooking page than you just get nothing but scrapbooking and not all my other nonsense um, so that is it. Um, otherwise, I'll see you ladies later.